All right, this is basically a Python skill check. I'll show you a few snippets and for each one you should pause the video and decide what actually happens or what's wrong with it. If you write Python regularly, you should be able to reason through these. Most people can't, so don't run the code, pause, think, then unpause. Let's see how solid your Python really is. First one, imagine n is very big. Does this run at the same speed all the time or does it get slower and slower? It gets slower and slower. Each loop creates a new list and copies everything into it. When the list is small, you don't notice. When it gets big, it becomes very slow. Second one, if this runs on a lot of real data, can you always trust the results? Not always. Floating point numbers are not exact. When you add many of them, small errors appear. Number three, after this runs, did we change a or only B? We change A. This slice does not create a new array. It points to the same memory. So changing B also changes A. Number four, when this finishes, do you always get the same number? Nope, you don't. Updating X takes more than one step. The two threads can mix their steps. That means some updates are lost. Last one. Do these two calls create two cache entries or just one? Just one. Python treats two and 2.0 as equal keys, so the cache cannot tell them apart. If most of these felt easy, that's good. If a few surprised you, that's normal. And if all of them surprised you, this video did its job. 